you played with Phil Jackson. Yeah. Right on championship team. Right. Next. Used to be his roommate, and we really? came the same year, actually, 1967. That's so funny. Uh, I was first round draft choice. He was second round draft choice. So. And you're that an athlete, an ex-athlete who's still an athlete. You're in amazing shape. I don't know if you can tell at home, but what's your routine here? I never eat at Clyde's Wine and Dine. Ah, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> He's lying. He, yeah. uh, you, you pretty much eat the same thing every day, don't you? My favorite meal is grilled salmon and grilled chicken. And chicken. Clyde with uh, occasional baked potato and broccoli and asparagus. I'm sure the chef knows how to make your food, you know, oh, yeah. to your perfection. But he hates me. He's like Clyde. <laughs> no, eat no, something no. else. Try something. Well, different. because you, you do have a great menu of wine and dine, and the, you could have the the healthy stuff, and then you could have the stuff, you know, that you want to like splurge on every now and then. Right? Oh, that's true. That's true. Chef, what, what's, what do you have planned for the World Cup party coming Okay, back? we have a, you know, a Brazilian menu. We, I prepared a Brazilian menu, and today we're going to make the Rizoles, which is the uh, Brazilian style turnovers. Brazilian oh. turnovers? Oh, yes. Those look okay. pretty darn good. Yeah. Right I'm here. glad Clyde doesn't want any of those because I <laughs> yeah. want more for me. Okay. So, Chef, tell us how to do it. Okay, so we start with the filling. You know, make sure we have a pan and olive oil to start. And then make sure saute onions and red peppers. Everybody loves his sauces yeah. at the restaurant. They do, right? Yeah. yeah. And make sure when you saute uh, the onion and peppers get soft. Once, once your onion and pepper is soft. While he's doing that, by the way, yeah. Clyde's is located where, Clyde? 10th Avenue and 37th. Not so. too far from the garden. Yeah. No, not at all. Clyde, you never have one pig out day? There's never a day you say, you know what, I'm going to eat a bag of Doritos. <laughs> no, yesterday I had some french fries. Oh, and? <laughs> it was good. <laughs> All right, once you saute, we add the ground beef. And Make we sure. ground that, right, yeah. Chef? Yes. And, and Clyde, let me ask you about your clothes. Broken. Because you are um, one of the snazziest dressers I've ever seen. So are you. I must compliment you on your wardrobe. But yeah, but yours, you know, yours, when you walk into a room, you're like, Clyde's here. Do you know what I mean? You stand out. Look at that jacket. You got a little leather sometimes you wear sometimes, right? Oh, and the animal prints. <laughs> that is cool. The thing is, you, I, mean, I have a theory here. You athletes, tall guys like you, you have to get custom made clothes anyway. So why not go for a little flair? Am I on yeah, stuff yeah. in there? Yeah, yeah, that's true. Uh, plus, tall uh, basketball players are like models. They're tall and slim, so usually what they put on, they're going to look good in. So, But you I just like it. a pizzazz. I hate, uh, I disdain the mundane. Yeah, I, so you would never wear like a solid color? No, I used to. I have to add some pizzazz <laughs> to it. I like that. I disdain the mundane. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to, words to live by. All right, how you doing over there? All right. Uh, okay. Uh, when we have the ground beef, yeah. so it's going to take about 10 minutes, and, and then we start putting the rest of the ingredients. Tomato sauce, oregano, paprika, cumin, and chopped garlic. Beautiful. You saute that yeah. a little bit? Yeah, we saute this a little bit. It's going to be take around 15 minutes to 15 20 minutes. minutes. And then when it's all said and yeah, done, can we see what we're... And we have the result right here. Okay which is the filling. And after that, when we have everything, so we can get the risoles crust. You put it in one of those things and you yes. wrap it up, right? Yes. Kind of like is. a dumpling. Dumpling and then you deep fry it. Yeah. That's delicious. And then we just close. There's that little dumpling thing. Yeah, dumpling about. thing. Clyde, do you know how to yeah. make anything in the kitchen? No, I'm very handy. You are? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what can you make? What's your specialty? What's the same thing? Chicken, turkey. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that healthy venue he likes. Salmon. Yeah. yeah. That's Oops. nice. Oops. Stir fried right. vegetables. Here we go. Rosanna. Okay. The line. I, will I get... think I'm going to try one. Really? really? Without the sauce. This yeah. is good. Is there a Armando. Good, good mm. stuff. Here you go. All right. What are the hours of your restaurant, by the way? We open for lunch, and we the kitchen closes during the week at 11, mm -hmm. 12. Uh, 12 o'clock on the weekend. No double dipping. Oh. I saw that. No, but I dip from the other side. See that? Is that alla <laughs> allowed at one and I nine? I dip. <laughs> Your customer's <laughs> always right, right, Clyde? <laughs> all right. That's right. All right, so Clyde's is going to have a big Brazilian party this week. We'll put all the information on our website. Go see Clyde Frazier at Wine and Dine in Manhattan. It's all about the World Cup. Thanks, Clyde. That's right. Are Come we? in. Get your kicks, please. Get all right. Are you, are you rooting for any team? Because you know who I'm going for, right? 
we don't even know who's playing. <laughs> <laughs> the world, we're not big soccer people around here. I know. All right, Clyde, we disdain the mundane. Be right back. All right.